How we doing guys? Myself Chris Predit OBE here and you have a quick one. Real talk, true season, look a walk and talk right now. This video, very concerning. Don't care what anyone says. Very, 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 very concerning. One, she's a grandmother and my little man just kicking her down like this. And this is the reasons why I'm not overly saying that, oh, you should go around beating your children, you should go around. Discipline. Discipline now, that's what I'm talking about. I'm barking at discipline. But because the government's gave so much rights and so much laws to young people, look at what he said. Yeah, they only takes this one kick. And what hurts me is someone's filming it. So someone's old enough to be filming it, to know that it's wrong. And there's other kids throwing slippers and throwing stuff. And even when someone does step in, it takes someone so long to step in and support the grandmother. And this is the reasons why I'm saying mothers and fathers. You're almost there. I know it's great to have support and you don't always have the greatest of support. So you got to rely on who you got. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? But you cannot leave your children with your mother or with your, their grandmother and they're, and they're abusing their grandmother like that. It's, it's disgusting, absolutely disgusting. I'm actually horrified in what I've actually saw. And these are the kind of times when it's 2022. Remember them days when it was to be like, oh, it's only the white kids that are rude and all the rest of it. White, black, mixed heritage, it doesn't matter. All the kids are rude right now. They don't have no respect for no family members, no mum, no dad. Like, he put his hand on his grandmother. Think about what I'm saying. Think about how old she is. Think about if she actually fell down and slipped her disc, broke her back. You know what's there? Because when you get older, you get very, very fragile. So my question to the government is, as much as you're coming up with schemes, as much as you're trying to help domestic violence, women cases, knife crime, my whole solution is you should be putting back more laws into the actual parents' hands. Because it's funny how when I'm sitting there and we're blaming the parents like, oh, knife crime, knife crime. Whose kids are these? Whose kids are these? But at the same time, where's the rights gone? The parents do not have no rights. If they ground their children, their children still walk out. They can't do nothing about it. If they hit their child, you know once their social services get involved. If they chastise their child, social services get involved. And when they go to social services, if not, they get more leeway being at social services than they do at their own parents' house. So my whole question is, we can sit there and moan about parents. We can sit there and moan about fathers and mothers. But we have to sit there and look at the laws that are put in place. And I do believe that the kids are running too freely. And I'm not just saying it lightly. I'm saying it for the ones that need it. Some kids need a little bit of a slap right now. I'm not going to lie. Some real discipline, some real, real, real discipline. And I don't know whether it's gone to a stage now where parents are slacking. I'm not going to lie, where I never, I never want to hit my kids because I was hit when I was young. I get all of that. But if you're not going to put boundaries, if you're not going to put discipline, if you're not going to put respect, morals within to our children, these are the kind of things that are happening. And what's concerning is the fact that he's doing it to his grandmother, the fact that he's doing it to family members, it can only imagine what he's going to be like when he's older, to the public out on the street, how he's going to be towards women. Because you've got to remember, this is deep right now. He's put his hand on his grandmother, but that's a woman. So if he's already putting his hand on women, what is that going to lead to down the line in the long run? Very, 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 very concerning. This one here really, really hurt my heart, man, to see young people right now with no care and no discipline for any adults. And when they're adults, it's the one that's actually supporting you, putting food in your belly. You know what's their clothes on your back? So if it wasn't for your grandma, you could be in care right now, big man. So these are the kind of things where it really, really, really breaks my heart. But please, guys, share this message. Keep your children safe, most importantly. And let's try and help our parents, and if not help, other mothers and other fathers get back their rights to their young people. What's you guys' thoughts? Comment below.